In this video, we will show you how to disassemble and clean your Dispenset S and how to replace spare parts. Your Dispenset S is designed for precise and effortless operation. To ensure optimal performance, even after long-term use, regular cleaning is important. Additionally, the instrument should be cleaned under certain circumstances, immediately when the piston is difficult to move, prior to changing the reagent, prior to autoclaving, prior to disassembling the instrument, prior to long-term storage. Your dispense head S should be rinsed prior to changing the reagent and before disassembling the instrument. Mount the instrument onto an empty bottle and empty it completely by repeated dispensing. If the instrument is equipped with a recirculation valve, it must be emptied in both the dispense and recirculate settings. Mount the instrument onto a bottle filled with a suitable cleaning agent, for example, deionized water, and rinse the instrument thoroughly by repeated filling and emptying. We recommend cleaning your dispense at S immediately when the piston is difficult to move, regularly when using liquids which tend to form deposits, for example crystallizing liquids, prior to autoclaving. The trace analysis model has a different design. Please consult the operating manual for cleaning instructions for this model. Start by rinsing the instrument. Then pull out the filling tube and the optional recirculation tube. For analog models, set the instrument to the maximum volume. Unscrew the piston seat completely and carefully pull out the piston. For digital models, also set the instrument to the maximum volume. Move the latch to the left and remove the front housing. Place the tip of the mounting tool into the piston mounting nut and turn the mounting tool counterclockwise to loosen the piston mount. Remove the rear housing including the counter. Then carefully pull the piston out from the cylinder. Remove the discharge tube. Then use the mounting tool to unscrew the discharge and filling valve. You should not disassemble your dispense S any further. Carefully remove deposits at the edge of the glass cylinder and rinse the piston and cylinder with deionized water. Then clean the cylinder with a bottle brush and a suitable cleaning solution. Wipe the cylinder and piston with a damp cloth. Piston and cylinder must be dry before assembly. Check the valves for deposits. If needed, loosen the ball valve using light pressure. You can use a 200 microliter pipette tip. Clean or replace the valves as needed. Both individual components and the complete instrument can be cleaned in an ultrasonic bath. The housings, pistons, and cylinders are individually matched and must not be interchanged with pistons from other instruments. For analog models, insert the piston halfway into the cylinder and reassemble the housing. Screw the piston seat into the housing. For digital models, insert the piston in the cylinder. Then put the rear housing onto the piston cylinder unit and tighten the piston mounting nut using the mounting tool. Then mount the front housing and close the latch. Screw in the valves using the mounting tool and attach the discharge tube. Then attach the filling tube and the optional recirculation tube. Your dispense S is now ready for use again.